Arriving at forward position. I passed through here once. Pre-invasion. A lifetime ago. Not much left. Advanced teams scattered a perimeter wall around the entire city. They're setting blast charges. Good. Trip, any sign of those villagers? Not yet. I'll take a closer look. Infernals could be watching. Stay alert, stay alive. We have to reinforce this position. Make it quick. Quick time. Hey everyone. I am here with Stormgate. Uh, this I is the long-awaited RTS from StarCraft II no and a Warcraft Three veterans, um, which is pretty much easily Some apparent. Sort of supply cache. Poor bastard didn't get to use any of it. This is the second Wait. mission of the oh, six it. mission campaign. Uh, it's essentially chapter one. Uh, since this game is Finding in early way. access. That's all that we have, and they're kind of using this as a baseline to kind of redefine and reconfigure what it is that they're going to be doing with. Uh, we'll need more bobs. So, uh, you know, RTS veterans will be kind of right at home here, especially for those who've played. Starcraft 2 or even Warcraft 3 like give me the lowdown Amara here she is a hero character that she's got like Gotta loot on her that enhances certain abilities she's got powers which is I mean it's not far off from what Starcraft 2 was doing but I think this aligns a little bit more with Warcraft 3 And so you've got your command post, which can be upgraded later. Putting up a barracks. Habitats are needed next. Placing structure. So we want to make these habitats because <laughs> now we're talking. Time to They're train gonna... some lancers. They're going to give us the expansion that we need. Not enough luminite. Yeah, well, we're working on it. Not enough luminite. So, uh, the bread is supply, and then you've got the Ethereum, and then you got the Luminite here. I'm, I'm not collecting any Ethereum, and I don't need it. Not enough Luminite. Position secure. Riker, time to knock on the front door. Uh, but, like, I could build a biokinetics lab. Command posts. Elsewhere. Go, go, go. I get uh, so I'm I'm a turtler. I I like to turtle in these games. I just do. So, you know, even the UI kind of resembles both the games that I've already mentioned several times, like. It's just, it has that look and feel, and it's kind of providing that next thing. So a lot of the campaign stuff, like the, the cutscenes, even the missions themselves can be, and may be completely different by the time that this game comes out. They are really oh, I've been ready. trying to figure out what they need, uh, what they want to have. Not enough luminite. So I like turtling, I like building up uh, huge forces long before I go on an, on any kind of attack. It's just it's just what I like to do. Not enough luminite. Lancer 
If you can't tell by the horrible gameplay and the way that I use the mouse instead of keys, up in the upper, upper left here it does say my name, so you can tell that I am ready. playing this. So ready. As shocking as that may be. Could build another barracks, but you know. Who wants efficiency? I'm so ready. Ready. Uh, really good detail, really good. I've got everything maxed out. Uh, I'm not doing like anything crazy to lower my graphic settings for like so efficiency and speed or whatever. We did get a to get a little blip, didn't we? We're almost ready. We'll go with these last two and then roll out. We've also got an incoming like raiding party. So on future missions, you get like sentries that you can place. I've got these buzzsaw cannons, but there's like actual like sentry turrets that you can place. Uh, there is, you know. Uh, PvP as well. Um, that's never really been my strong suit. I have never been much of a PvP person uh, when it comes to RTSs. That's just not my thing. But there's also co-op. Quick time. Heading there now. Finding a who needs to die. Oh. Hello. Oh, I'll take that. Hello, I said I'll take it. This looks ancient. Could be important. Let's keep our eyes open for us. Explosive barrels can take the block quickly. So now I because I found an artifact, it's going to unlock other ones. Time to pin. That I can find I uh, for for bonus things. Area secure, Commander. And yet, I don't feel safe. Where? Oh, got it. Quick time. Taking him down. Time to pay. Use these explosive barrels against him. And boom. We threw everything we had at them. Wasn't enough. Another relic. This is worth taking with us. So shooting his explosives will clear the way. Finding a path. Need to intercept this party. Death wish bread. But what I should be doing. Just doing that. And then we will we will do it. We'll build that extra barracks. Give me the lowdown. Making a beeline. Go south wait. here to that other question wait, mark. Wait. Where? Oh hi. Oh, Quick time. Heading there now. So like that chocolate bar. Uh stale now, wholesome ingredients consumed to restore health and energy. Finding a path. So it's just a neat little What does this little, kind of little trinket? Let's hope we don't find out. Go get it go up there. Woo. We don't want that. Make it quick. These guys are brutal. So are we. Shoot that. Oh, well, okay. alright. Death wish breath. Here I come. Oh, got rid of that guy. Insufficient supply. There we go. Now we get this last artifact. Another relic. This is worth taking with us. Why wait? Insufficient supply. Another bar. Where? Oh, got it. 
Quick time. Oh, we got a. There we go. Oh, we got some luminite shards. Another you little know, note. I definitely think the Lots of reading material. But damn. Humans so intercept these guys. Our forces are under attack. Let's have them meet up. Oh, we need to build <laughs> habitats. So if you hold shift, you can create multiples. And what's cool about these bobs is that they will just kind of go right back to work on the main thing that they were working on. They just know that they're being sidetracked for one piece. So oh, we're there. stationing everybody there while we build out new units. I'm so ready. Uh, I could upgrade and get these ba these basic ranged infantry, but there's really no need for it, especially in this mission. Uh, but let's let's take what we've got. Here I come. Why wait? Where? Oh, got it. Death wish granted. They're loading the prisoners onto havoc transports. Havoc. What? Scumbag mercs. They'd sell out their mothers just to get ahead. Transports are lifting off. We need to follow the prisoners. Negative. If this stronghold survives, more people die. We finish this. Yep. But they're alive. Clear them out. That's an order. Understood. Hey, look at these guys. What's next? On my way. Let's get to it. I'm so ready. Quick time. Heading there now. Wow. Look at all these parts. Make it quick. Get rid of the Gugan monster. All right, look at this. Death wish bread. You can see that, like. Units are leveling up and getting better in C and all that sort of stuff too. Malak will be pleased. Gotta get rid of these smaller units. Our forces are under attack. Malak comes for his prize. We will deliver you too. We completed our objective and now we're, you know, on to the next mission. So as you can see, it's six levels here and uh, there's also a co-op mode. Um, I do have the kind of the ultimate edition of the game. However, uh, Sima Liu's character Wars is uh, a character I would still have to purchase, but I do have everyone else available. Uh, there are unlocks, there's gears, there's cosmetics, like there's like pets that you can unlock. Pet 2, uh, have like a different fog of war. So on and so forth. Then there's the versus mode where you get to play as one of the three factions. So in the campaign right now is just the Vanguard. That's all the missions for them. 
Uh, I'm assuming chapter two will be the Infernals and then three, the Celestials. Uh, similar deal he here with the all the cosmetics. And uh, 1v1 matchmaking. You can uh, also get into uh, melee or arcade, which up to 64 players, which is wild. Um, but yeah, I mean, as an early access offering, I think Stormgate is off to a really promising start. I think the foundations of like, you know, what these games are about and who's made them in the past, like, is going to be very interesting. I'm excited to see where it goes from here, but it's off to a really good start. And, you know, if you crave for that new kind of Blizzard-like experience, I think, th I think this is something to look at. I will put a link to the game in the description below. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.